welcome guys uh so in this video uh let's talk about this uh vendor corp inequality okay so i think a uh, seldom people knows about this uh random uh sorry this vendor corp uh inequality because uh this is actually the a very uh amazing uh, uh inequality from Kurdish words and uh, basically it's also uh proud somehow using the probability theory so it's like uh, the it's amazing it's the linear algebra and, and the intersection with the probability theory. So let's talk about this inequality. Okay, so let's see we have a complex vector space. So you can view just some finite dimensional complex vector space. I call it V, and then there's an inner product space. Uh, there, this is an inner product space. So let's assume that there's a uh, this is the inner product form. Okay, so let's take Let's take a v and a u1 up to un. So this is a vector uh, v and a n n vector n n n u1 vector n uh, sorry n vector the label by u1 up to un and also the norm of v is one. Okay. Uh, then. Okay. Then the, what we have is. Let's say uh, we have like a. Let's say we do the inner product of v and ui, and uh, do this. So this is uh, this is the some complex number, right? We take a norm and take from i one to n, and then this will less than or equal to the product. So i and j, ui, uj, square. Okay, and uh, this ij is basically from one to n. Uh, so this is v. Okay, so uh, let's uh, develop some intuition of what the hell is this is going on, right? So let's suppose you have u1, u1, u2, u3, and uh, some un, and you have some vector v, right? So uh, you can view the v u i square as a correlation of v from uh, u i. So v u1, norm of v u1 square is basically the correlation from v and u1. And uh, VU2 is square is basically the correlation from V and U2. Okay, so basically the left hand side just tell you that uh, suppose the left hand side is large, right? So that means there exists some U such that uh, or, or or basically there exists the sum of U basically that VU uh, VU is large. Right, but uh, you will in so ideally then you will in uh, it will show that uh, the correlation of the this ui and uj must be somehow large right because uh if the correlation of ui and uj can be arbitrarily small then somehow you can view that this ui uj are very far from uh are very far from uh, there's no relationship of of it right so then the is that this v cannot be uh then this term cannot be so large okay so this is just the heuristic argument so let's see a proof Okay, so this proof is from Koji Watts. Let's uh, see a proof. Proof. Okay, so uh, let's start from the left hand side, right? So let's maybe v u y is basically like this. Right, this is the left hand side. So let's maybe let's just let's take uh, let's take this right. Uh, let us take like v u i right. V u i is just a complex number. It right? can be written as v u i. Take a norm and left epsilon i. So epsilon i is a complex is a complex number, and then also epsilon i has a norm one. Okay. So this turn this turn uh, can be written as let's say epsilon i and the v u i i from one to n. So it's basically uh, v i from 1 to n u i epsilon i right so this is a linear combination of epsilon vector okay uh right and but there is a square here right so we need to take a square right square okay so this is the inner product uh this is the inner product of v uh so this is the inner product of, of v and uh, this combination of u so this by the Cauchy Schwartz. So let's see uh, Cauchy Schwartz. Right, so Cauchy Schwartz tell you that uh, if you have two vectors a, b in the product square, then you will add less than a square and a b square. Right? So just take the norm. 
So that become less than VV. And also the inner product of this. So the inner product of this will be, let's say, will be epsilon i, epsilon j, ui, uj, i and j. So this is just product of this. Okay, now I, we, I assume that uh, v is uh, norm is 1, right? So this guy is 1. So this original term uh, will less than equals to i from 1, j from 1, to n, epsilon i, epsilon j, and the uh, ui, uj. Okay, and uh, remember that this epsilon i can almost be 1, right? So this guy is less than equals to ui, uj, i from j to 1 to n. Okay, so this is the proof. Okay, so this is the famous uh, Ven, uh, Ven the corporate uh, inequality. Okay, so I I find these inequalities and in, at the Terence Taus block. So it's amazing. So I give a proof. Okay, I will see you guys in the next video. Be sure to subscribe to my channel. Thanks.